Hey guys, and welcome to today's video. And today we have some more NASCAR Heat 3. Uh, this time we have Flex Tape. Uh, this is um, uh, the Daytona 500. Uh, but this is the number zero Xfinity series car flex tape is actually like really really good tape from what I've heard um, it's like really really strong and it's really sticky and it like it's so amazing that it literally could stick anything even stuff like underwater uh, which is how powerful it really is um, there's like two versions there's like black tape and then like clear tape so you can like see through the tape um, th this is like from it says flex seal products there so the company is flex seal and they make like stuff like flex tape um there's also like flex glue with like that's got loads of colors as I crash into right uh I think is it Ryan Reed I'm not sure he's spun and that is the end of stage one uh, but there's lots of different colors um of flex glue uh let's move on to stage number two. Okay guys, so stage two, um, but we are pitting, um, in terms of flex glue, there's like, there's like white flex glue, I'm not sure if there's black, I think there's like, there's almond, there's clear flex glue, um, and this, this, all flex glue works underwater, and it's like, this really sticky, uh, glue. Um, it uh, it also works underwater. Um, there's like also flex shot, which is like um, I don't know. It's like I think it's like flex glue, but just like it's white. It only comes in white. Um, and it's for like in your house like I don't know what it is I think it's like a is it a sealer is that I think that's what they said in the commercial uh, I'm not really sure um, there's like uh, flex there's flex seal which is like a, a spray paint and it like um, if you like chainsawed a bucket and then you put flex, like multiple layers of flex glue, uh, seal even, like loads, like multiple coats, it would actually reseal as we take the lead, yes, uh, on lap two of stage two, um, But, um, there's like different colours of flex seal, um, like a rainbow of colours uh, that you can use. Um, there's also like little mini flex uh, things, like flex tape, that sort of thing. Um, they're like small. So they're meant to be like portable so you can like take them with you like wherever you go um, I mean like there was a there was this race at the Daytona 500 uh, where this exact guy Gareth Smithley he uh, he was involved in a crash I think it was in 2016 or something like that 
And then what happened was they actually flex glued taped even the car back together in it. Like he wouldn't. I don't. He said he don't, didn't think that he would finish the race without flex tape. Uh, as we win stage number two um, of the Daytona 500. Okay, guys. So we are moving on to stage number three. Um, I've actually just noticed there's like this um, black bar on the top and the bottom of uh, of the screen. I don't know why. Um, but we are ready to go green here at the Daytona 500. There is now eight laps to go. Um, we are in 20th place because we pitted. Um... You can see I slightly move Matt Tift up the racetrack. Um, I felt like the car's a little bit jittery in the in the corners. I mean, I can't really because it's like a bank turn. It's not like a flat turn. It's kind of a bit jittery as I try and move Ross Chastain up. He's, uh, he's got a flex seal livery. Um, but uh, we are moving up the field quite nicely. Oh. Old oh, guy, shut the door in my face. Um, as we go past him. Contact with Gallagher. I don't know his first name. Uh... Approaching Dale Earnhardt Jr. with the number 88. Three wide down the back stretch as we catch up to Brandon Jones, number 19 Menards, Toyota Camry, and we ease past him. Uh, catching Tyler Reddick in third. Can we go around the outside? Yes. As we get the draft from. Kaz Grala kind of moves down his Ford Mustang GT number 61 goes on the outside as we take the lead of the race for the second time that is first place but it looks like we're going to have a little battle for the lead as Elliot Sadler, has Sadler goes on the inside we appear to be going quicker. We're still at the lead. I'm going to give him room. There's no need to squeeze him. Because he could spin me out. Oh. Nearly contact there. Uh, going side by side. Coming to the um, start finish. Straight. No, it's not really straight, it's a drive, what am I talking about? I'm going to go wide again. Going very, very close to the wall. And he's gone up the inside. Contact with Kaz Grala. He is going quicker because I think, no. Well, I, did, I think he did have the draft from Elliot Sandler. I'm going to go wide I'm going to cut down, I mean, Tyler Reddick could have been there, but he wasn't, which is good, um, if he had been there, I would just just gone straight back up, um, get in the draft, try and go up the inside, go below the yellow line, and I still can't get past, this is a three-way battle for the lead. This is very intense. Um, can we get the draft of Elliot Sadler? Yes. 184 miles an hour down the back stretch. Getting the side draft. But no, he's up he's on the inside, so he's gonna have to take less uh, distance around the corner. 
he squeezes me to the point I have to hit the wall. Um, try and get the draft just so we can go a little bit quicker than Kaz Crawler. No, he cuts down. I nearly made contact with Kaz Grala. Tyler Reddick is way back. He is nowhere near this battle for the lead. This is a three-way battle for the lead. This is usually like a two-way battle for the lead. But this is three-way. Literally. We can't go up the inside. I thought we might. But no. Kaz Grala has gone there up the inside. But we're going to have the draft of Elliot Sadler getting past Kaz Grawler again. He's still on the inside. Yes. We're past Kaz Grawler. Can we get past Elliot Sadler? He's literally on the inside. Can't go up the inside. Oh, now he's left a door open. Down the back stretch, contact. He's all over the road. Get a bit more draft. Now I'm going to be the one on the inside. He's going to be the one on the outside, and I am going to try and hold it. I'm going to go up to block him a bit. Now he's tucked in nicely behind us as we go into the trival. For the last time before it's the end of the race. There's going to be no room for him. I'm going to go absolutely as close to the inside as possible. And go right up to the wall. Down the back stretch. Give him absolutely no draft whatsoever. Right in the middle of the road. And I'm going to go... Get a nice line coming through the final corner. I think that Elliot Sadler is not going to be able to get back past. He's too far back coming to the trial for the final time. That is a win. And that was amazing. Um, that was a brilliant three-way battle for the lead. I came out on top. With Elliot Sudler in second and Kaz Grawler just off the pace, really. Uh, I'm going to reverse so we can do some donuts on the grass. Flex tape is in victory lane at the Daytona 500. That is an amazing win. We started like what last, I think. Um, but uh, yeah, um, NASCAR he thought is out right now, so you can buy it. Um, I just haven't got that yet. Uh, I will definitely uh, get that like for Christmas or. Um, Oh, I've gotten a bit stuck there. Um, I'm just going to reverse. I can't because the front split is going to hit. Can we go down here? Yeah. I'm going to I'm going to go on the concrete because it's it's better to burn out, I guess, and the tires get to suffer more. So yeah. The engine is not really happy with me doing this, but uh, I don't really care because we've won. We're going to exit first. Speed rating is 92. Not bad. Um, yeah, we've got the trophy there. Flex tape on side. This is number zero. Uh, you got the flex seal right there. See, um, oh, that was an amazing race. 
And we got the fastest lap of the race as well. That was just amazing. What an incredible race, guys. That is the end of the video, though. Uh, I hope you enjoyed. Remember to subscribe and like the video. And I will see you in the next video. Bye.